please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Title, Troubleshooting Python Requests 401 Error with Web Authentication Introduction When working with web APIs or services in Python, the requests library is a popular choice for making HTTP requests. However, you might encounter a situation where your Python script returns a 401 unauthorized error, even though the same URL works as expected in your web browser. In this tutorial, we'll explore common reasons for this issue and provide solutions with code examples. The HTTP 401 status code indicates that the request has not been applied because it lacks valid authentication credentials. This can happen for various reasons, such as missing or incorrect authentication tokens, session cookies, or other required headers. Ensure that your Python script includes all the necessary headers required for authentication. Some APIs might expect specific headers like authorization or user agent. If the web service requires authentication, make sure you are providing the correct tokens or credentials. This may involve using API keys, OAuth tokens, or username slash password combinations. Certain websites use session cookies for authentication. In Python, you can handle cookies using the requests library's session object. By following the above steps and ensuring proper header inclusion, authentication token handling, or session cookie management, you can troubleshoot and resolve the 401 unauthorized error in Python requests. Always refer to the API documentation for specific requirements and details. ChatGPT Title, Troubleshooting HTTP 401 Errors with Python Requests When working with Python and the requests library to interact with APIs, Encountering HTTP 401 errors, unauthorized, is a common issue. This error indicates that the server rejected the request because the client lacks valid authentication credentials. If the same URL works as expected in a web browser, it could be due to differences in how browsers handle authentication. In this tutorial, We'll explore common reasons for receiving HTTP 401 errors in Python requests and provide solutions to troubleshoot and resolve the issue. Before we begin, make sure you have Python installed on your system. You can download it from python.org, and you'll need to have the requests library installed. You can install it using Ensure that the URL and endpoint you are using in your Python script are correct. Typos or differences in the path could lead to authentication failure. Some APIs require authentication through headers, tokens, or other means. Check the API documentation for the correct authentication method and ensure your Python script includes the necessary headers or tokens. Replace your underscore access underscore token with the actual token required for authentication. Some APIs may require session management to maintain state between requests. Use the requests.session object for this purpose. Some servers may reject requests without a proper user agent header. Include a user agent header in your request to mimic a web browser. By following these troubleshooting steps, you can identify and address common issues that lead to HTTP 401 errors when using Python requests. Remember to refer to the API documentation for specific authentication requirements and always handle sensitive information such as access tokens securely. ChatGPT